Hello everybody, in this video I will show you how to install the latest version of MinGW which is MinGW W64. Also I will show you how to build a C++ file using this building tool. So first of all we need to download it and to install it. That's why I will go to the navigator and here I will type MinGW W64. So I will go to this first link then I will click on downloads and here in this list I will click on min gw w64 builds then I will click on this link and here I have to wait few seconds for the download to start of course I will download the installer which is this file so I will save it on my computer and I will save it on the desktop So the installer has been downloaded, so I will run it. Now in this window I will click next. Then in this window I will select this latest version. Then for the architecture I will choose this value. Then for the other parameters I will accept the default values. Then let's click on next. Here I will accept this location where MinGWW64 will be installed and then I will click on next. Now I have to wait for the download and the installation to finish. Now let's click next and as you can see the installation finished successfully after about 3 minutes. So let's close this window and this is not all because we need to set the environment variables. So here I go to the location where MinGW has been installed, then I open this folder, then I go inside this folder, then MinGW and then I go into bin which contains the different uh, building tools so I need to copy this path and to add it to, to the environment variable so let's copy this now let's go to the environment variables so I go to system then advanced system settings and in this window I have to click on environment variables then I have to update the path variable so let's click on edit and here I will add the path at the beginning of this value to provide this path with the highest priority. Of course, I need to add the semicolon as the separator between the different uh, paths. So let's click on OK, OK, OK again, and now let's close this window. Now to create a new C file, or a new C++ file, I will just create a new folder on the desktop and I will call it project1. Then inside this folder I will just uh, copy the C++ file, so this is it, which contains this simple uh, C++ code and to build this uh, file I need to execute this command from the command prompt so let's copy this now let's open the command pr uh, prompt from this folder so I will type cmd here and here in this window I will just type the previous command and then I will hit enter so as you can see, this is the executable file. It has been created. So let's run it. And as you can see, this is the output of the file. Now, if I want to build a C++ file using the make file, uh, I cannot because the MinGW that I have installed does not contain the make tool. So if I type make here, I obtained this error because I did not install the make tool which is included with the MSYS uh, framework. So in the next video I will show you how to install the MSYS with MinGW. 
Thank you for watching. I hope that this video was useful for you. Please subscribe to the channel.